This is Naomi, and this is Coffee with the author for IJustFinished.com. And I have two amazing young ladies with me today. And girls, tell me who you are. Well, I'm Brianna Winner. And I'm Brittany Winner. And we're the authors of The Strand Prophecy. And how long have you been writing stories? Well, we started writing about a year and a half ago to two years ago uh, for our first book. Now we're on our third book, and we just finished our second one. But you actually were writing stories before you got published, right? Actually, we were not. We always loved to story tell, and we always loved movies. But because, okay. well, because we had severe dyslexia, it was very hard for us to write. So you were doing the oral telling of stories like, then? Yeah, just to each other, you know. Oh, that's great. Okay, where did this story come from? Uh, the story of Robert wrote the book. Uh, that you wrote the book about. Oh, well, we've always loved comic books and superheroes, and we thought, why not make a superhero with no powers? We put everything we wanted into a book. Okay, and are you girls in the book? We actually put uh, identical twins in the book, named Trib and Rose. My name is Brittany, Brittany and uh, Trib is Brit, backwards and inside out, and Rose is Brit as well. Very good. Okay, now your dad helped you with the book. Yes, he's actually a JBB winner. And, and, I'm sorry. It's all right. Um, our uh, pen name is JBB winner, which is Jeff, Jeff, Brittany, and Brianna Winner. So we wrote it all together. It was collaboration. Equal collaboration. Very good. So you guys are the creative source, and he's making the. Actually, we all come up with ideas together. We all say that if. Every single one of us puts our own ideas into it. It's all equal collaboration. We all do our own part. Yeah. That's great. Now, did you find that your dyslexia created problems? Definitely. The reason why we wrote the book was because in about fourth grade, it started to show up, and we didn't know we had dyslexia, so we felt extremely stupid about ourselves. When you're the last one done on every subject, you feel stupid. And our father said we were not stupid. And to prove to us we weren't stupid, we do the impossible. Write a novel. So we did. Perfect. I would like to thank you girls thank you. for thank visiting you. with us today, and we will find you on ijustfinished.com. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me go back here a little bit. Okay.